Hey guys, I'm Brady and you're watching 1MS TV. Now in today's episode, I have lots in store for you. If you're looking for something that has power, elegance, and grace, just sit right there. I got something just in store for you guys. Cars affect the way we feel. A bad car that's either ugly or keeps breaking down can put you in a bad mood. Whereas a good car that's good looking and fun to drive can make you feel on top of the world. Take this E350 convertible. It should make you feel awesome. It should make you give your money away. Help old ladies cross the street. And I wonder if Pootie Pie would splat her shit all over this car. Nah. <laughs> the feeling that this car gives you isn't positive at all. The E350 just makes me angry. I feel evil. I remember telling someone a few weeks ago that driving the E350, it made me want to strangle a horse. But not out of malice, just out of pent up lust. The E350 might make you feel nasty, but it really is a nice piece of design. It's obviously beautiful to look at on the outside. Its soft sensual lines contrast beautifully with the aggressive front grille, opposing elements that are brought together beautifully by the muscular proportions. To me, it's the sexiest car Mercedes-Benz produced. Maybe ever. What's really cool is the attention to detail. It feels good. It feels just right. I love Mercedes. But I gotta say that the interiors haven't always lived up to the exterior height. But they really nailed the E350. It looks fantastic. I'll be the first person to admit that driving a car like you stole it is a lot of fun. However, you can get just as much enjoyment from driving the Mercedes E350 extremely slowly. This is the type of interior that you feel proud about. You want to show your friends and people. And if anyone just touches anything just once, apart from that grip for their life, I'm going to break every bone in their body. As I head out for a night on the town, I just can't help to think how good I feel. It really is that great of a car. It makes you feel good. Whether you're inside it or looking at it from 50 feet away, it's magic. And if none of that impresses you, well, you're probably dead inside. The steering is incredibly responsive. Just tiny inputs gives you big movements. There's no need to throw the steering wheel around. This car is almost telepathic. The E350 is an emotional roller coaster. Every second behind the wheel stirs up an internal cocktail of lust, fear, happiness, contempt, hate, love. This is a car that makes you feel good. It makes you feel bad. It makes you feel alive. <laughs> 